Good luck. Triple teamer. I mean, I'm sorry. Bogo Divisions. Pauly N kicking it off. Get it? Football kicking it off. Guaranteed a top tier. In my favorite product. Select. Good luck. All right, Card Rustler, you'll have spot three, which is my name in the randomizer for that NT. I think I put it in there for a filler we were doing, but it never filled, so. How's the buddy store doing, card wrestler? Tier 1 looks like this. Tier 1 people looks like that. A month later? Yeah, that happened to me once with the $2,500 item, but I won it in the end. Because I sat on the phone with uh, eBay for like three hours a day till they gave me, gave me my money. I literally talked to them for like two hours once. Demanded... I said, I'll talk to everyone, anyone in that damn company, but this guy ain't getting my money. It was some old item I found in a in a uh, short sale we were doing. And um, it had turned out to be some really expensive speaker from like 1960s. And it was never open. It was factory sealed. I opened it from the factory sealed to look at it. And there were still newspapers from like 1963 that they used for stuffing inside the tubes. And um, I put in there like, I don't know if this thing's going to work. I don't know what it is. It's being sold as is. I put that in there 50 times. And um, long story short, the dude got it. And then like a week after, filed a claim and said that it was broke or something. That he didn't want it. Basically, he switched out the tubes which were worth the money. But I won. Just sucks having your money tied up for like three months or three weeks. Like when the people stole five grand from me in PayPal. Remember that? In February? Had five grand tied up for a month. Screwed up all my accounts and nothing. It just was sucky. Like when you don't have $5,000, you're kind of short for everything. It sucked. I had to take money out from this other place to make up for it, which ended up costing me more money. Hogan, you got the AFC West, NFC East for Ryan O, NFC North for Harv, NFC West for Paul, AFC South for Harv, AFC East for Ryan L. The NFC South is Hogan, and the AFC North is Paulie N. Yeah, you just got to keep calling them, Scorp. You got to call them, you got to call them, you got to look at the, look at the listing. You just got to tell them to it realistically, like, look, dude, this guy's obviously pulling a scam. It doesn't take a month to figure that out. That's day one stuff. Hey, this is damage. Let me, uh, can you do something about it? They'll go back and look at all the conversations you guys had. Don't yell at the guy because eBay doesn't like that. Because I yelled at the guy. And they're like, uh, Mr. Keller, I mean, the way you talk to the guy doesn't appear as though you're kind of a nice guy. I'm like, I am a nice guy. He's a, a liar. It's like, don't tell me I'm not a nice guy. You talk to the guy who's trying to pull a scam on me. Look at my listing. I followed every single rule. You guys ain't 
I ain't losing my money. Ryan O has the NFC East. Oh, he's he's. He, I don't know if he's he doesn't watch Jason. I mean, he watches, but he doesn't chat. But he can. Uh, he might message me. If you can't see chat, Ryan O, there is a um, request for the AFC West and the NFC South for your NFC East. Yeah, because when he first wrote me, I did get pissed, and I was like. Dude, I know exactly what you're doing. You know what I mean? Blah, 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 blah. And the way he talked back to me got me all in a tissy. Because that was the first time it ever happened to me. So I wasn't thinking like, oh, eBay's going to look at this conversation. Yeah, hopefully you have a good account too, uh, Scorp. Because I told him to look at the other guy's account and look at the history, which sucked. He had all kinds of negative things about him and stuff he was doing. And I had 100% dopeness. <laughs> so that helped. And just talk to him like a human. Say, look, man, this is my livelihood. I'm not giving up my money. Any trades? Final numbers. Our teams. AFC West for Hogan. NFC East for Rhino. NFC North for Harv. The NFC West is owned by Paul Yen. AFC South for Harv. AFC East for Rhino. NFC South for Hogan and the AFC North is for Paul Yen. Well, when I went through that incident with eBay, which was, I lived in Skokie at the time. I lived near you, uh, Scorp. I remember when I get on the phone like that and I'm seriously in like negotiating a deal or I'm talking to someone in customer service, I pace and I walk laps around the block. I must have walked around the block literally 20 times. But I asked them. And they're very experienced people, the eBay people. Once you get to the top, if you talk to them in human terms and let them know, like, really, this is this ain't right, you know, they should side with you, really. They reward those who will do that. If you don't do it, you'll lose. I should put on my oven mitts. Well, there you go, Scorp. Sean McCoy. Shiny. There is a blue Jeremy Langford to one. 25, Jeremy. Come on, Jeremy. I hope you have a good year. NFC North for Harv. Which, by the way, Harv, I heard from Heather. She's good. She's uh, just been busy with work and life. Nothing happened. Nothing bad. She's all right. She's alive. It's definitely more important things in life than this. I tried telling Hogan that, but he doesn't listen to me. This goes to whoever was the fifth defensive player selected. If one of my friends could look that up, that would be cool. Here comes an eagle. Here comes an NFC East. Carson Wentzer to t to 10. Oh, <laughs> it's a beauty. Oh, yeah. There you go, Ryan O. CW, my favorite card, the Tenors. Love them.
yeah, there's there's not much more beautiful that can hang with a number to ten select shiny auto. That's how you do it. Now, just got to get this guy to play good. And that will be a money card. Yes. In fact, I rubbed my fingers all over it. You know, because those selects grade so well and all. Those big chunky ones. Probably will get an 8 now, since I didn't have my gloves on. Pretty sure it'll be an 8. That's how much of a difference it makes. Because it's not a... Uh, it's not a uh, novelty or anything to use gloves or a scam. Big Ben. That will be 99er. AFC North. I'm excited about this case of NT. Yeah, those are good. Let's uh, break without a Duke Johnson. Duke, Duke, Duke of Earl, Duke. Well, I'm going to get some welder's mitts. <laughs> I'm going to get some welding mitts that the welders use or the guys that, you know, at the glass blowing factory, those big heavy duty leather things that they wear when glass blowing and handling molten steel. That's what I'm going to get. Some dope welding mitts. Sit down, your dad's here. Who has the fifth defensive player draft in the NFL? I'd like to know. How about a Geo to 15? Good box, man. AFC Norther. That'll be going to Paul Yen. Ouch! Yowzers! Is that Ashley or is that Ashley or Ernie? There's that's that's a that's a big factor there. <laughs> Who was that? Paul. Paul. I'm sorry to have my gloves on, dude. It's going to grade an eight now. I should have wore my novelty gloves. 148, 149. Yeah, I should have put on my gloves for my novelty act. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 